Hi there. I hope you are safe and doing well. Um, I thought while we are all at home, I could show you a magic trick. Um, in the second half of this video, I am going to teach this trick as well. So if you enjoy it and want to learn it and perform it for your friends and family, uh, please do stay for the second half. Great. So um, I have ace through nine of diamonds right here um, in an ascending order, as you can see. Now, for this trick, we'll try and play a game where your aim will be to try and mix up the cards as much as you can and I will try and influence your choices. Um, so I'll, I'll dribble the cards down and then you can either say single or double. Single would mean I would put one card down like that and you can say single again or you could say double which means I swap the order and then put the cards down. So you could say single double single and then there's only one left it would have to be a single now just to make sure we're on the same page you could say single or double right now before we begin uh, there's a prediction right here that I've I've made um, and it's going to stay there so keep an eye and make sure uh, I don't tamper with it in any way at all um, and another note is that we can, we can I'll triple the cards down for as long as you want me to so you can stop whenever you want um, there's not a specific number so let's begin single double 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 single sing. double 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 single Single, single. Right, do you want to go on? Yeah, okay. single, double, 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 single, single. Right. One more time. Okay. Single, 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 double, double, single, single. Great. Now, we did it as many times as you want me to, right? And we also swap order whenever you said double so um, let's look at the order we have come up with now before we started this I made a prediction and I haven't touched it since then and haven't tampered with it at all and somehow I predicted the exact match 357 Six eight nine is four two, an exact match. Great. Now that you've seen the trick, uh, we can talk about how it's done. It's a really fun and easy trick. All you need is ace through nine of any suit. Um, it could be diamonds, hearts, doesn't really matter. And then you need to put them in an ascending order, just like this. And then you need a marker and a piece of paper. Uh, once you've got that, you need to write these exact same digits in this order and fold it up. Usually when I'm performing it for people in person, I hand them this digit and ask them to put them in their pocket or just hold on to it. Um, and that works really well. Um, so this is how you do it. You explain the game, the game uh, to the spectator. You tell them that they can say, uh, that they're going to try and mix up the cards as much as they can and then you are going to try and influence them um, and so when they say single you put one card down and if they say double you put two cards down just like this right so it doesn't really you see why it doesn't matter uh, whether this is single or double because why are you explaining the game to them you're just setting up the trick which means you need to do it in, you need to explain the game in exactly this order. So you'll say, you can either say single and then you can, add, you can say single again, or you could say double, which means you put two cards down, which swaps the order. Then you can say single, double, single. And there's only, if there's only one left, it would have to be single. Now you do this one more time just to make sure they're on the same page. You say, you can either say single, or you can say double then you take these three cards and then put them at the bottom of the pile 
Now, you can see what this does is this sets up your trick. This is the exact same uh, order that you've written in the chit. So this is how you set up the trick. You just do it right. In, you do it in front of them without them uh, knowing. And then here's here's the most important bit. People think that you're changing the order when they say double, but you really aren't because you don't flip the cards. So if I, if they say single and then they say double, it doesn't really matter because even regardless of that, if they had said single three times, I would have just put the card one by one like this down. So single or double doesn't really change the order. It only changes it if you flip them and put them face up like we did when we explained them, which is what fools the spectator. So it doesn't really matter if it's a single or double. Now here's another thing that you should note that once you go through the nine cards like the first time it reverses the order so as you can note as you can see it starts with two and ends with three instead of doing the opposite but if they do it one more time let's say they they want to do it one more round and this is single double single double it doesn't really matter it can be just completely random um, this would bring it back to the original order so all you need to remember is uh, if, they, if they ask you to do the round like even number of times like two, four, six, eight, it would come back in this exact same order and then all you need to do is reveal the cards from left to right but if they ask you to do it odd number of times which is one, three, five, you get it you need to reveal the cards from right to left once you've done that you can tell them that you mixed them up as they wanted you to and then you can ask them to bring out that chit and then you can do the final reveal just like that.